Quickly before we start the video, I'd just like to say be sure to hit that sub button if you enjoy my content and also the notification button to stay updated on my latest uploads. Yo, what is up guys? That intro is pretty cringe. I'm gonna get a new one soon. But anyways, welcome back to a brand new Clash Royale video. Today, we're gonna be sitting at 666 trophies, going in Arena 2, trying out the all Electro Wizard deck with spells. So we're just gonna basically try to win with the Electro Wizard, try to do most of the damage with the Electro Wizard, and kind of use the spells to assist it. So we're gonna first go in with a mirrored Electro Wizard with the Rage Spell, Fireball, Log, you know, all that good stuff, including the Rocket for a 3 crown clutch so let's see if we can actually win by using the electro wizard and not just spamming like four rockets at him and taking the three crown instantly but still guys if you enjoy this video i want more clash royale drop trolls like this be sure to smack that like button down below can we hit 200 likes on today's episode but still we already took that one crown with the electro wizards and look at that the electro wizards are barely letting the king tower attack them and if i had like four electro wizards down including like some from the clone spell that would completely just annihilate the king tower and it would stop um the king tower from attacking too especially um at these lower levels where you know the king tower barely does any damage and has super low health but even if i was versing like a level 10 and i got four electro wizards to his king tower with his arena tower not assisting i still could do so much damage to him and just completely destroy his king tower with mirrored slash clone electro wizards but still his prince isn't gonna do anything to my tower it's only level one and my towers are level 11 so here comes the skarmy um we're just gonna zap all of that out so it can't get to our tower and we just have to like drop a few more electro wizards on his king tower and that should be gg right there um we're just gonna cycle through with the fireball let's drop a log there too we could actually just win by rocketing right now i just noticed that um let's see yeah, I think, we, yeah, we could actually win log, I mean, not ro log, rocket, and then zap or arrow, so now we can just win by rockets, but still, we're gonna try this out and try to win with the electro wizard, so he has a giant coming towards our tower, we're just gonna drop, um, two electro wizards right there once we get enough elixir, but still, um, let's just do it right there, I don't, I don't think that's gonna do much to our tower, look at that, level two giant's already going down, so we're not gonna drop that, um at our tower anymore we're just gonna go straight for his king tower just look at that second electro wizard is coming down um i think we only need one more rocket to win so i'm just gonna end this right here one more rocket taking out the three crown or taking out the king tower and giving us the three crown hopefully we can get um some better battles in our next few um games especially since these guys are like total garbage in bone pit and he just dropped a crying face. Good game, Ui. We actually put the clone spell in this deck because I just realized I had the clone spell missing. So that was really fucking retarded of me to do that. But still, let's see what we get next. We got Christian from Fear, level 5 player. Gonna give him a good luck and a crying face. We already got the Electro Wizard ready to go. We just need the mirror and we can get four Electro Wizards to our tower. Look at that. He already has an expo right off the bat. I don't actually want to use my Electro Wizard to defend against that, but I think I have to. Um, um, just because the expo is like the only thing that can actually take down my tower at this meta or at this um, arena still um, we are gonna completely annihilate everything he has just with that electro wizard just because it's so powerful especially at this um, level or at the level these players are at so I'm gonna give him a rage face just because he's using the fucking expo so we're just gonna rocket his tower just to punish him for using that shit um, that cannon should go down right there and he has no defenses up anymore uh now we also got the rocket i don't know what i'm supposed to do right now but he's gonna send a giant in mini pack look at this perfect rocket taking out most of the giant's health and take out the mini pekka and that giant's probably only get one shot off my tower but since it's a level four giant it's barely gonna do anything and so he leaves the match holy shit did he just leave the match did he just rage quick because my rocket just completely destroyed his giant oh my god now i'm just gonna psych okay shit he rejoined well, anyways, we're just gonna cycle through all this shit. I know he's gonna drop an expo soon. Okay, there it goes. Fucking noob. Dropping the electro wizard right there. It should stun the expo and, like, prevent it from attacking at all. 
it's just so overpowered just to see that electro wizard do some work on the expo and the prince i mean it's not gonna do much it's gonna go charge towards my tower but my level 11 tower easily takes it down so what i'm really focusing on right now is cycling back to my electro wizard and getting it to the tower to take the three crown on this guy we have the mirror we just don't have to use it and we don't have to use the clone spell then we can get a perfect electro wizard push going at his tower to take the three crown so we're just gonna drop the rage spell right there just to cycle through and here he has the cannon down so just a few more cards and i can get to the electro wizard what i'm really worrying about is his expo so i'm just gonna save my expo for that i don't even know why he just rocketed right there uh we're gonna drop a fireball right there i think he's also cycling to his expo so um this guy might also be trolling or dropping trophies to bone pit the troll but here comes my electro wizards and that lagged for a little bit i don't know why though but still uh we should be able to take most of this out shit one of my electro wizards died and look at that look at that a single electro wizard right there just taking out that can't, I mean, not that cannon, that prince and that baby dragon. It's not going to be able to do shit against me now. Um, we're going to fireball right uh, there and take out that cannon and that giant. Dropping both of these electro wizards right there. Um, I don't know. His expo should be coming down soon. He has barbarians. And, oh shit, we just missed that clone. But still, it doesn't matter. We got three electro wizards down. We should be good right here, guys. Oh shit, the clone electro wizard is going to die. The expo is going to go down. And here comes the rage spell. Just look at that. Look at those two electro wizards go under the rage spell. <laughs> and that instant one crown right there. Give him a crying face. Give him a laughing face. Christian, that's what you get for being a dick and using the expo. Still, it's super funny to troll these noobs down here. I definitely recommend you guys drop down here, especially if you're grinding for a clan chest or getting it for your clan i definitely recommend you guys drop all the way down to bone pit or goblin stadium so we are up against jade only a level two 700 trophies i think this guy is actually um playing on his second account right here or this might be his second account so it's gonna be really bad especially just to troll this guy i actually saw a level one in barbarian bull earlier and i just let him win i, I let him w win because i felt bad for him but anyways here comes the dual electro wizards and we got the clone spell already in our first cycle this should be really good okay or not he dropped the giant skeleton right there we can't do shit because that electro wizard is gonna take out that knight too and that giant skeleton is actually gonna get to i guess our electro wizards and take those out log took out all the skeletons so rip and there goes all our electro wizards we could have taken his tower and it would be really funny just to see all those four electro wizards go but he's gonna drop a baby dragon that's not gonna do anything to our tower we just have to cycle back our electro wizard is next so um maybe we'll push his other tower or we'll keep going for the right tower i don't really know right now um Let's see, we're just gonna drop a rocket on his left tower and we're gonna just keep his right tower on the other side. We're not gonna do anything about his right tower, but we'll just continue um, grinding for the left, I guess. Alright, the Electro Wizard is in our cycle finally, so we're gonna drop the first one right there in the back and we're gonna mirror it together. And now we got the clone spell ready, so we should be able to clone that any minute. I don't think he has his giant skeleton up because I didn't see him cycle through that much, so that witch is gonna take out the fucking clones, which is really annoying. Fuck this guy for being a dick. But still, his giant, look at that, the Electro Wizards aren't letting that giant move at all. That's pretty hilarious to see, just the Electro Wizards shooting down that giant and not even letting it move. So the tower is dead at 16 HP, Electro Wizards just taking it down right there. And look at that, oh my god, Did, are you guys seeing this? The giant skeleton isn't even attacking because of those Electro Wizards. I'm gonna play that shit back again. This is actually really cool right here, giant skeleton goes down. It moves towards the Electro Wizard, and the Electro Wizards just keep attacking him, refusing to let the Giant Skeleton even hit them. That's pretty cool, and it's broken in some reason, especially if you mirror these Electro Wizards. So that's why I think Supercell actually balanced them out to, I guess, make them one shotable through fireballs and other spells like that. Alright, so now we're gonna go for the other tower with the Electro Wizard just because I don't think he's gonna let us take his three crown easily. So here comes the clone spell. It's gonna clone both of those Electro Wizards. Holy shit, he just lightning both of them. That was so bad. We could have gotten four Electro Wizards down at the same time, but he decided to lightning two of them. Holy shit, but at least we got a second tower. I mean, we got the two crown on this match, and if we just like do one more push on his crown tower or king tower we could get the three crown at the end of this battle so i'm just gonna have to defend against all of this first we got the electro wizard down we're gonna drop a one here on one right there and holy shit this guy could have been more of a dick dropping the giant skeleton right there i'm gonna clone all of those 
And I think I actually reset the Electro Wizard's outgrow to make it target the Giant Skeleton. So we actually ended up taking the L on this one. We didn't get the fucking 3 crown. But still, pretty good game with the Electro Wizard just trolling these dupes. So if you guys enjoyed this video, I want more drop trolls like this. Be sure to smack that like button down below and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next Clash Royale video.